Hello guys, welcome back. It is Title Domination once again. Uh, obviously last episode I did round up the first season at Zaragoza, so this is the start of the second one. Uh, as you see, the 1st of September, so I have played a few games into the season, including the friendlies. Uh, I'm going to go straight into the transfers now. And as you can see, Joe Valencia left to go to my old club, Arsenal, for £13.5 million. But that's not a bad thing, because uh, we've got Ignacy Miguel to strengthen the defence, which is also a really good acquisition for the team. Um, but yeah, he's the kind of only guy I spent money on this transfer window, as you can see. But Dean Cracknell got him from LA Galaxy on a free. Let me do it from Bury Town, who are like Conference South on a free. Marek Steck, a really, really, really underrated goalkeeper on this free. Michael Pereira, obviously good, good player. I can't. I, can't, I was kind of shocked that he was free. I mean, I have, I've paid a lot of money from a farm previous games, but um, yeah. Free, so it's a good bit of business. Um, moving on to the second part of this, obviously two from Juventus here. Marchetti, who is an amazing, amazing striker. Um, Braga has got to fill in the left and left back and right back positions, and also Casarani, Casarini, sorry, who is actually turned into a hell of a hell of a player. Um, but yeah, as you can see, I haven't spent a lot of money. Mostly freeze. I think it's positive eight million pounds I've I've made so far. But yeah, I think I've got a good enough team now. I just need them all to blend together. Maybe half through the season we'll start performing as I want them to do. But um, yeah, uh, let's go into a few games now. As you see, we lost the first friendly uh, 3-2 in Legans. The team did not start hitting performances here, so I changed the formation around. Went back to 4-3-3 like I originally wanted them to play. And this happened 5-1 against Real Betis B. Obviously, I know they're not the best side, but as you can see, Marchetti there with a hat trick. Gunnar Olafsson scored, and Kerrison got one. So the team is starting. Obviously, here they are starting to perform. Um, the next 7 in against Ontinient. 4 for Marchetti here. Cracknell there got two, and Raul Rutten. Never heard of these before, so I can't exactly comment on if this is a good result or not. Um, next. It was our first game of the season, as you can see, drawn with the Rayo. Marchetti Kerrison on the score sheet again. Um, they did take the lead twice and we had to get back, which I wasn't really happy about. But away from home, we got beat by these last season, so about that there. Um, so we'll see how it goes. Next game, at home, Marchetti penalty, 51 minute, 2 0 against Racing. Good, good result. These beat us last season, so it's good to see that we are progressing. But I think there's still a lot, a lot, a lot to go. Um, that's it for this. I mean, I know I've rushed through this one, but there's really not a lot to say. And I hate, I'm really conscious about how long these are getting. So I hope this is really quick. Keep you up to date. Next update will be coming in a few days' time. It will be, episode, this is episode 10, so next one will be 11. And it will be halfway through the season. Thanks for watching, guys. Stay safe. I'll see you guys are out.